it is the morning of Brad and Kat's wedding. I am so excited and I'm in like full event ready mode. I've got an eyebrow appointment this morning because these babies are the dummy dirty. Let's just say that. Um, and because we still have lockdown restrictions in Perth, we will be wearing more so they are good eyebrows. This is what I'm wearing and it's like a silk navy dress with some ruching on the side. I'll be wearing these little nude heels. I've got a nude bag. I'm just going to be doing like some nice and glowy makeup. So here we're waiting for our eyebrow appointment and because we were still in lockdown restrictions, I of course am wearing my mask. So I haven't been vlogging this morning. I've had a crazy morning. I am now picking up my friends Grace and Jess. We are going to get ready for the wedding. I got my eyebrows on this morning, so that is all done. I am excited to do my makeup and my hair. It's now one o'clock. We've got to leave the house by three. I'm just plugging in my charger. Okay. Giving you know, ourselves lots of time to get ready, which is what we like, because the last thing you want to do when you're going to like an event or a wedding is be caught off guard and be like rushing and like sweating like crazy at the last minute. So time to get ready. It was so hot the day of the wedding that I'm just cooling myself off here with a fan. And yeah, it's like 28 degrees and we have no aircon upstairs. So just doing my best. We're headed on our way. Ellen and Emmett so nicely chose to drive us. Again, with our masks on, COVID life. Okay, so I couldn't film much of the ceremony because I didn't want to intrude. It was so beautiful though. I can't even express this. It was my first wedding ever and it was just so personal and beautiful and we were all like crying. The person next to me was crying. My friends were crying. I was crying. And she picked out everything perfectly. When we walked into the room, we were like, this is Caitlin. I can't believe how much she has hit the nail on the head. Then we went for a little walk, had a drink, and they whizzed the room around into the reception room. Amazing workers. So we've just finished the ceremony. We are now having a drink, enjoying it with Jess and Grace. Grace, well, Grace number two. Yeah. They're taking the photos now, so we're enjoying a drink while we're waiting to go in for the reception. And we're very excited to eat because none of us have eaten since breakfast. Yeah. <laughs> so Oops. we're all keen for a feed. So, and we're so excited to see Caitlin. So again, I was trying not to talk too much in the middle there, but they had like these buffet style share plates in the middle. The menu was amazing. Everything we ate that night, I would eat 10 times over. It was fabulous. I can't even, I'm salivating thinking about it. <laughs> So we're like halfway through the wedding. <gasps> Kayla looks beautiful. We have cried multiple times and the speeches were great. And I'm just like, it's just going so quick. I'm like, it's 8.30 already. It's going to be done time. And then we're just going to go home. I have to go home. I go to sleep and I don't want to. <laughs> oh my gosh. So it is lemon cheesecake, chocolate brownie and butterscotch pudding. Look at that. I will be back to you later.
some dancing. Honestly, my friends and Kat and I were dancing the whole night. I ended up taking my shoes off because my heels were hurting my feet so bad because I danced that much. And I can say with certainty, weddings are awesome. I want to go to one every weekend. It was so much fun. Oh, and it just made me feel so very single because there was so much love in the air, but it was magical. So that is all for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for being here and for watching. Let me know if you've been to a wedding, what you liked best about it, because I would love to know. If you haven't already, please make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe because it really supports me and my channel. I will see you next week.